I want to go over a document. It is called 60 Symptoms of Demonic Attack. The name of the website is Lighthouse of Prayer Ministries. Number one, a compulsive desire to blaspheme God. Number two, a revulsion against the Bible, including a desire to tear it up or destroy it. Number three, compulsive thoughts of suicide or murder. Number four, deep feelings of bitterness and hatred toward others without reason, Jews, other races, church, strong, Christian leaders. Number five, any compulsive temptations that seek to force thoughts or behavior that the person truly does not want to think or do. Number six, compulsive desires to tear other people down, even if it means lying to do so, vicious cutting by the tongue. Seven, terrifying feelings of guilt even after honest confession is made to the Lord. Number eight, certain symptoms that may appear suddenly or leave quickly and for which there are no physical or physiological reason. Symptoms such as choking sensations, pains that seem to move around and for which there is no medical cause, feelings of tightness, about the head or eyes, dizziness, blackouts, or fainting, seizures. Number nine, deep depression or despondency. Ten, sudden surges of violent rage, uncontrollable anger, or seething feelings of hostility. Eleven, terrifying doubt of one's salvation even though they once knew the joy of salvation. 12. Seizures of panic or other fear that is terrifying. 13. Dreams or nightmares that are of a horrific nature and often reoccurring clairvoyant dreams that may even come true are most often demonic. 14. Abnormal or perverted sexual desires. 15. Questions and challenges questions and challenges to God's word. 16. Sleeping or eating disorders without physical cause. 17. Most compulsions and obsessions. 18. Rebellion and hatred for authority. 19. Bizarre, bizarre, terrifying thoughts that seem to come from nowhere and cannot be controlled. 20. Fascination with the occult. 21. Involvement in criminal activity. 22. Extremely low self-esteem. Extremely low self-image. Unworthy of failure. No good. Constant undermining of the self-identity. 23. Constant confusion and thinking, sometimes great difficulty in remembering things. 24. Inability to believe even when the person wants to. 25. Mocking and blasphemous thoughts against preaching slash teaching of the word of God. 26. Perpetual 
distortions perceiving anger or hostility in others when it doesn't really exist seeing only judgment in the scriptures 27 horrible nightmares causing fear often having demonic images 28 violent thoughts suicidal homicidal self-abuse 29 hatred and bitterness toward others for no justifiable reason 30 tremendous hostility of fear when encountering someone involved in deliverance work 31 deep depression and despondency frequently and at significant times 32 irrational fears panic attacks and phobias 33 irrational anger or rage 34 irrational guilt or self condemnation to the extreme 35 desire to do what is right but inability to carry it out 36 sudden personality and attitude changes severe contrast schizophrenia bipolar disorder 37 a strong aversion toward scripture reading and prayer especially one on one 38 a dark continents steely or hollow look in eyes contraction of thieve pupils sometimes facial features contort or change often an inability to make eye contact 39 lying exaggerating or stealing compulsively often wondering why 40 drug abuse especially when there are demonic hallucinations 41 eating obsessions bulimia anorexia nervosa nervosa I don't know 42 compulsive sexual sins especially perversions 43 irrational laughter laughter or crying 44 irrational violence compulsion to hurt self and or someone else 45 sudden sudden speaking of a language not previously known often then often an ethnic language of ancestors 46 reactions to the name and blood of Jesus Christ verbally or through body language 47 extreme restlessness especially in a spiritual environment 48 uncontrollable and mocking tongue 49 vulgar language and actions 50 loss of time from minutes to hours ending up someplace and not knowing how they got there regularly doing things which there is no memory 51 extreme sleepiness around spiritual things 52 demonstrations of extraordinary abilities either ESP or telekinesis 53 
voices heard in the mind that mock, intimidate, accuse, threaten, or attempt to bargain. 54. Voice that refers to him, her, in the third person. 55. Supernatural experiences, hauntings, movement, or disappearance of objects and other strange manifestations. 56. Caesars. Too long and or too regular. 57. Pain without justifiable explanation, especially in head and or stomach. 58. Blackouts. 59. Physical ailments such as epileptic epileptic seizures, asthma attacks, and various pains. 60. Sudden temporary interference with bodily functions, buzzing in ears. I heard that once. I sure did. And ability to speak or hear. Severe headache. Had that also. Hypersensitivity in hearing. Or touch, chills, or overwhelming heat and body. What? Okay. Numbness in arms or legs, temporary paralysis. Note, a few symptoms may not indicate, may not indicate demonic oppression, but these are very common symptoms for those under demonic attack. Very awesome article here. So I hope you guys can understand this. God bless.